Today I'm shooting a theme and the theme is two circles. Themes are really good for any kind of photo challenges and um, themes are good because they limit you. You get to focus on something. So today two circles I will try to find them somewhere on this little photo walk. Uh, let's see what this fo photo walk will bring us. So let's start the walk here. Two circles is the theme and uh, I'm bringing my R5 for this 50 mil. I'm part of this um, photography community or uh, sorry club and they every year or sorry every week they have this theme and uh, and the theme of the week can vary from more difficult themes to more easy themes and I'm setting my camera up with 125 and f5 1250 ISO I want to keep it quite simple and try to just shoot when I see something that is nice something that works actually I was coming to this spot because there's some construction going on uh, so I was thinking if I walk around this place I will probably find something cool let's see I haven't been shooting this that much in this in this part of Helsinki there are some really beautiful old houses here uh, and also also this old merchant hall place we have a few of them in in Helsinki and we're coming to one to to one of them here at Hietalahti. Hietalahti. Yeah, I'm never remembering the name. So this is the one, the house I'm talking of. This is the merchant hall. And uh, yeah, let's see if we find some circles. Or am I just walking in circles? Who knows? It's a good question. There's a car that's broken down. Oh, it's kind of broken. Maybe there's there's some cool details that could be circles. Two circles. It's a lot of circles there. Circles. That's circles, actually. How would that be? done somehow circles within circles there's a spike maybe something like this what it's definitely two circles and circles within circles actually I saw this really inspiring walkie-talkie can link to it uh, because there there was this artist this photographer in in New York who was he was actually shooting more of uh, people people um, people that uh, uh, like more like tr tracks of people being there, like evidence of people being present uh, at some point. Like, if as he explained it, sorry for rambling, as he explained it, he is not interested in going to a party to shoot people there, but he's more interested to come when the party has ended so that he can shoot the the remains of the people the trash that people leave behind all that kind of stuff 
is more interested, interesting for him. Yeah, viewing the world through the things we leave behind gives perspective. Helsinki is very grey right now. How can we make two circles out of this? There's this orb over here. Uh, it's possible to make it somehow into two circles. There are stickers that are around. makes a cool picture but what story does it tell I don't know no oh got two ones let's see there's two beside each other the two circles that I'm looking for these are not the two circles you are, we are looking for. I always look for people when I shoot. When I when I shoot some images, I I need to feel there are human humans in the shot somehow. Otherwise, I feel I don't know. I easily get bored by images without without people in them and I know that there are so many good shots shot where there are where there are no people in it but for me I need, I need, I need people, I'm a people person, what else, there's a sailing boat here, probably stuck on ice, as I said themes are really good because when you have a theme you have to limit your thoughts, so if you're ever outside on a photo walk and you don't know what to shoot, I encourage you to limit yourself somehow. You can limit yourself by by shooting on, on a, in a certain way with, for instance, like slow slow shutter speed, or you can limit yourself by having a theme, like maybe some colors that that must be present in the sh in the photos. You can limit yourself by having. Uh, you can limit yourself by having. Um, uh, by shooting in black and white or shooting in color you can limit yourself by sh only shooting cars or shooting people maybe for me at least I think one one thing that I find a bit boring sometime with street photography is that I only shoot people that are walking but if you limit yourself to to, to focus on shooting people that are uh, doing something somehow uh, because when people are doing something on the street there but it's a different thing and also for some people that might be a a not always so easy to do because when people are doing something we feel like we are interfering and uh, this is a cool ship um, we feel that we are, we are interfering, so it's more difficult to maybe shoot the, take the shot. It also takes you into your, into your, like, out of your comfort zone, into your learning zone. And in the learning zone, it's where you learn, haha, <laughs> of course. But if you're only in your comfort zone, you will not grow. In the learning zone, you will fail. In the learning zone, it will take more energy from you. When I did the minimalistic street photography video, for me it was something new. 
And since it, since it was something new, it was eating a lot more energy out of me than, than what I regularly do. And uh, so that's something you have to take in consideration. That's how you... And, and I, I'm not very proud of many of the shots that I took because I felt they weren't that good. And that was because, of course, I was in my learning zone. I was learning something new. Other times I just go out shooting. I have no goal. I just shoot. That's when I'm in my comfort zone. One more shot of two circles and then I think I'm done. Done forever. Let's see. Two circles. Oh, what a sight. Looks quite cool. Should I? Ooh. That was quite nice. Quite nice. Quite nice. Quite nice. No, 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 no. I don't know. Here I am talking to myself or to you guys, but all alone. Sometimes I feel a bit weird doing this. Talking loudly on the street just to. Talking out my thoughts loud, loud, aloud. But what wouldn't you do for a great shot? Hey, there's circles all around on that house. Cool. So what the camera club does is that they post this challenge every week, a weekly, a weekly challenge, and then you post it on 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 our our facebook page so you can have a discussion around the shots that people take why and maybe ask some questions comment give some feedback so it's a very good way i actually i joined because i thought it would be a good way to 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 get some feedback on On it all. I saw a friend. Boy, saako tulla moikka? Mä olin sillä, että kävelin ohi tästä sitten. Mä just kuuliks se tonne, kun mä sanoin, että tässä oli Miikan kaveri, mutta se ei varmaan tunnistanut. Joo, mä olin sitten, että joo, tässä täytyy... Mä oon just tekemässä videoita tässä samalla. Mä teen valokuvausvideoita. All right, so that was nice. Met a friend. All I think about is circles, circles, circles. Let's see what we've done. Party in some of these houses. It was a long time ago. It was an after party, you know. The after party, you know, you should actually go home, but you still choose to go to an after party, and you're like, oh my god, why didn't I just go home? I'm quite happy, happy actually with the two shots that I have. The one with the bike within the two circles and the other one with the orb or the two orbs. I was actually thinking that I could I could try to capture a good shot of a biker, but or but I felt it was too easy. As I as I was talking about comfort zones. I think the reason is I make things things a bit difficult is because it helps me grow. It helps me look at the world in a new way. It would be nice to do this together with someone at some point. So if you are in Helsinki, let me know. I would love to go on a photo walk with you. Uh, if you're not comfortable being in a video, we don't have to do it that way. But, uh, of course, if you are, then you are. But if you're not, we'll do it without the video. But I would love, I would love to, to have a discussion with someone about photography, about life. Uh, the way that person views views life 
it's getting darker so I uh, my my settings my settings are not really clear hey this is so nice that's nothing to do with circles but two circles that was a cool shop or was it a restaurant it was a restaurant oh I see circles This would be so nice if it would be dark and the light would be on. But there are circles here at the Taco Mall. Taco Mall. Very cool, very cool. like that that's the third third image of circles so I think I'm done I may be done for the day so how did you like today's walk leave me a comment below and uh, if you want to see more of these let me know I gladly take you on these walks and uh, Probably always also somewhere else than in Helsinki. Maybe I should go to some other city What city would that be? Let me know that as well. Hey, thank you for listening. Thank you for joining. Thank you for watching Hopefully you like the images. Take care Don't give up your daydream Peace <laughs>